Pastor Andrew, and this is Theology Thursday. Thank you for joining me. Today we're going to look at the question, why is Christian worship liturgical? Liturgical worship is worship according to a format drawn from sacred scripture. The words of the Holy Liturgy, that which we use every Saturday and Sunday, are words that have been handed down through us throughout generations of the church. And of course, there are variations in these words and in, in the form of liturgy and such, where it's used and, and, and how it's used and the type of wording. But the way we worship is pretty much the way the church has always worshipped. A, a liturgy is, is a format of worship drawn from the scriptures, and it is consistently the standard structure from which we format our worship. There, there are three main reasons why we as Christians use a, a form of uh, liturgy in our worship. Uh, first of all, it is most importantly a safeguard against what we might say as false worship. For where the word of God is wanting, there the devil rushes in with all of his lies. If the structure of our worship were left to the whim of, let's say, uh, a preacher or anybody else, then it would only be a matter of time before those personal whims would turn us away from the sound word of God. Scripture reminds us that there is nothing good within our own heart. Everything depends upon soundness that we find in the word of God. Therefore, it is right that our worship, liturgical worship, be continuously placed upon and in the sound structure found within God's Word. Secondly, liturgical worship is, simply put, using God's own words to speak back to Him. God gives us His Word, and we speak it back to Him. This is liturgical worship in a nutshell. Consider the Psalms, which have always been a prominent place in the worship of the church. They are both the words of God and words of prayer. He gives us the very words with which to pray to him. Liturgical worship is, in essence, the same thing. It's an employment of the word of God in our worship. We pray using the words he has given us. We recite the liturgy using the words he has given us. And we rejoice that he has indeed given us these words to use. Finally, liturgical worship connects us to the church across all times. The church, since the very beginning, has worshipped in a similar manner. And when we do, we connect back to the very saints of the past as we go into the future. Liturgical worship binds us together as the church across all times, where we worship indeed with angels and archangels and all the company of heaven. Thank you for joining me today on Theology Thursday. I look forward to our next topic next week.